Hi, I'm Brett Latigo, fisheries biologist, and today we're here on Ranch Brook. Ranch Brook is a, a stream that flows from Mount Mansfield, which is the tallest mountain in the state, um, and it provides us an opportunity to look at fish and other aquatic organisms in a stream that's pretty much in its natural state. Um, so there's not any development above it, it's part of Mansfield State Forest, and it's actually part of a long-term monitoring watershed. So this basin is being used by a variety of different groups such as UVM, uh, University of Vermont, Department of Environmental Conservation, USGS, um, and Vermont Fish and Wildlife Department to look at impacts through time. So we've been monitoring fish in this watershed since the 1990s, um, and that gives us a really nice snapshot of how things change through time. So we can look at different things in the stream. We primarily focus on fish and characteristics of the river that might impact fish. So we collect data on um, water quality. We also have temperature monitoring. So we put temperature loggers out in this stream every year, and they record temperature every hour. Um, and that can give us a really nice look at how temperature changes between years and between different time periods throughout the summer. It also provides a, an area to focus on that we can compare to other watersheds that might be more impacted or more developed. So the west branch of the Little River, which this connects to, the other side, if you go upstream of this, you have the Stowe Ski Area, which is much more developed than the Ranch Brook. So we can collect data from the west branch of the Little River, compare it to Ranch Brook, and see if those developmental pressures are impacting those resources that we are here to protect and conserve. So before we get going today, I just wanted to show you a little bit about the, the method that we're using. Um, when we sample streams, we use electricity, to, and we call it electrofishing. So this is a, a form of sampling that provides an electric current from a generator in this case. Um, the other form is a, is a backpack battery powered unit. Um, we find that the bank side generators such as this tend to be a little bit more efficient and they, they'll actually pull fish from cover using that electric current. So we have our generator set up here which provides electricity to a wand. So we have this wand here and from this metal part um, a current radiates from, you know, it, it's about two or three feet out from this ring. Um, and we can set this generator on different voltages depending on the type of fish that we're targeting or the type of stream that we're in. Um, because depending on how much stuff is in the water, so sediment, minerals, things like that, electricity will pass through the water more quickly. Um, and we want to do this in a way that we can stun the fish and net them and put them in a bucket without without hurting them. So um, if we have the, the electricity set correctly, as this wand moves through the water and the fish come within that electric field, they get stunned just long enough for us to scoop them up, put them in a bucket, and then they recover pretty quickly, almost instantly as soon as they're out of that electrical field. Um, here we have a switch box. So this is a box that has a switch inside and so that whenever I push on this paddle, the electricity will, will, will come from here. So this is also a safety mechanism to make sure that we're only using electricity in the water when this is, when this is down. Um, and then we'll go through the water, we'll go shock the entire stream, we'll take all the fish out, and then we'll do it again. And this is what's known as a depletion method. Um, so by going through at least twice, we can take all those fish from the stream and then we can estimate things like uh, population. Um, of trout, so we, we turn that, that, using those fish that we collect, we collect uh, length, weight data, and then we're able to calculate things like the number of trout per mile that we see. Um, so I'm gonna start it up, we're gonna hit the stream, and we're gonna catch some fish, and you'll be able to see, uh, see how this is done. Four. 
50. Weight 33. 